Today's video is a bite-sized one. I want to share a brilliant piece of advice that I got from an E7 engineer many years ago. I asked him what was the one piece of advice he'd give to any SWE on how to be successful over the long term. What he told me was actually quite funny. A diff a day keeps the unemployment away. He went on to explain that as a SWE, it's really easy to get stuck in a rut. You're feeling unproductive and that you just can't make any progress on your projects. To avoid getting into this slump, all you had to do was ship one diff per day, every single day. Just keep yourself active with the code, do something. Maybe it's a feature, maybe it's cleaning a lint message, or just a simple formatting fix, anything. Just keep the momentum and the streak going. His advice is really nothing groundbreaking if you think about it. It's simple physics, Newton's first law. A SWE who is coding, stays coding. Once you get the ball rolling, it's much easier to keep going than it is to stop. Just get those first few diffs out and then watch how your brain is suddenly primed to tackle bigger and more challenging features. I've used this advice for years and it's definitely helped me stay productive. Even if you objectively don't code anything useful that day, you can still get your diff count and your line of, count, line of code metrics up. These aren't strictly used for performance evaluations, but managers do look at how you compare in terms of others in quote unquote coding productivity. You never want to be in the lower percentiles and this is a good way to unblock your brain and also make sure you aren't at risk of a bad rating due to lack of code. People do get dinged for this in performance reviews, and I've heard many stories of promotions being blocked, especially from E4 to E5, due to low diff counts. They expect seniors to co code quite a lot, so do keep this in mind. A diff a day keeps the unemployment away. That's been today's bite-sized video. Hope you enjoyed and learned something. Let me know if you want to see more of these. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.